video we are going to see a problem on projection of planes for that here we have a question an isosceles triangle plate of 50 mm base and 75 mm height appears as an equilateral triangle of 50 mm in top view draw the projections of the plate if it's 50 mm long edge is on HP what is the inclination of the plate with HP so this is the question in front of us now first I'll draw the XY line and then explain the conditions which are given into the problem X file line VPHP. The question is an isosceles triangle plate of 50 mm base and 75 mm height appears as an equilateral triangle of 50 mm in the top view. So if it is appearing as an isosceles triangle in the top view, it means that isosceles triangle is in HP. Draw the projections of the plate if it's 50 mm long edge is on HP. So if the 50 mm long edge is on HP, it means the entire isosceles triangle is in HP. So I have to keep that edge onto the left hand side as we are taking the reference for projections of planes onto the left hand side. So I'll start with this. Drawing a light vertical line over that I'll mark 50 mm as the base because it is resting on this base. Seventy five mm is the height. So here is the isosceles triangle. I'll give the rotations to it. Next, here is the top view, and this is the front view of the isosceles triangle looking like a straight line. Now I'll make it dark. So here I'll make it dark. So this is the top view and here is the front view of the isosceles triangle. The condition is given here. An isosceles triangle plate of 50 mm base and 75 mm height appears as an equilateral triangle of 50 mm in the top view. Now we have to keep this edge AB constant because it is of 50 mm and we want an equilateral triangle of the same size. So AB is being fixed. Now I'll put or we can say I lift this rectangle about point C that is when I am lifting about it point C then these two sides AC and BC they will reduce and they will reduce and I am going to get the side as 50 mm which is the equilateral triangle. So next I will draw the other condition here that is for the equilateral triangle. Since we want an equilateral triangle in the top view, I will measure this side 50 mm and from here I will draw a light arc then keeping it onto the other side I will cut this arc. So here I am getting a point joining the point. giving the notations a b and c this point which i have projected it is a dash comma b dash next i'll measure the length of the cutting plane that is from a dash b dash up to c dash keeping it on a dash b dash i'll cut this line Here it will give me point C dash. Next, this inclination, I'll call it as theta. 
Now I'll just make it dark. Next, I'll make this line dark. Now here is the equilateral triangle in which all the sides are equal. This was an isosceles triangle. These two sides are equal. Next here I can say that this is the top view of the isosceles triangle in which point C has been lifted keeping A and B as fixed. So this is the front view which appears as, a, as an inclined line. Now into this question it was also given what is the inclination of the plate with HP. So I'll write down therefore the inclination of the plate with HP is theta is equal to it is 50 degree next after reaching up till here I'll give the dimensions mm and the height of this isosceles triangle seventy five mm and here we have the equilateral triangle. This is the true shape and here we have the apparent shape and with this the problem is completed.